What's the matter? Is something wrong? I got another letter from Dr. Williamson. Williamson? Wasn't he the specialist that treated you for a royal fever? That would be him. Hmm. Months ago, what does he want? He wants me to come in for blood work so he can make sure I'm cured. An angel brought you back to life. Trust me, you're cured. I know, but I can't exactly tell him that. So just throw the letter away. I have been. He keeps sending more. Oh, here's my granola. What's it doing in the trash? I just bought this two days ago. Who eats this besides me? Mmm, Leo. But no, I'll, I'll replace it, I promise. Um, Piper. Um, I don't want you to think I'm mine because, because I don't. But if um, Leo's gonna be living here, then I, I think we should probably set some ground rules, you know? Leo doesn't live here. He eats breakfast here. Uh huh. A lot. Maybe he just likes cereal. You really think he's here that much? He's like the big brother I never wanted. Uh, I mean, had. <laughs> Morning. Phoebes, um, Evan Stone, ever hear of him? Hello. Red Death? I've only seen that movie like five times. Yes, I know. Well, I'm doing a photo shoot with him today. How much do I hate you right now? Hmm. Unless, of course, the tabloid rumors are true, in which case I really hate you. He is supposed to be. <gasps> I do not want to know anything about him. I just want to take his picture and leave, and I need to go get ready. Uh, Prue, you don't think Leo lives here, do you? I mean, yeah, of course he does, but I mean, it's fine. It's as long as you're happy, that's all I really care about. Not that I was unhappy when I saw Leo all naked in the shower and just all wet. Okay, so you guys just need to make up some ground rules. You know, what's acceptable and not acceptable. And I'm serious. Of course I got your memo. You can't be serious. Have you read my report? 90 days ago, Pepper Halliwell was admitted here with a Roya fever. Within 24 hours, she was completely free of the virus, even though she failed to respond to any of the treatments. Dr. Williamson, I may be new to San Francisco Memorial, but I am very aware of your project. Then you're also aware of the fact that her recovery makes no clinical sense. True. But your subsequent test failed to reveal anything out of the ordinary. Look, I just need more time. I've only injected the primates with samples of the Halliwell's blood this morning. Piper Hollywell is fine. I want you to forget about her and concentrate on people who are sick. I am. Somewhere in this blood could be the key to unlocking a universal antibody. And if I agreed with you, we wouldn't be having this conversation. You will not terminate this project. Dr. Williamson, I believe I already have. All right, I'm not giving up. Thank you. 